You spoke about being mobbed off, what happened? Oh! <laughs> Hi guys and welcome back. Today I'm gonna do a QA. and a um, I asked you guys to ask, I feel like I went a bit too in. Um, I asked you guys to ask me some questions on Instagram and Snapchat. So yeah, I'm just gonna answer them. But anyway, just to clear up any questions that I haven't answered before. Yeah, it's just a QA, and a isn't it? I don't really know how to make it sound more exciting than it is. In your college accommodation, are you allowed TVs? Yeah, you're allowed TVs. <laughs> you're allowed whatever you want, it's like your room, do you know what I mean? Like, what's up, where do you live? Um, I live in London. Um, if you want to be specific, I live in South East London. If you want to be even more specific than that, I live in Bromley. The road is, no, I'm joking. If you had the chance to live forever and not age, would you? Um, see, I've actually thought about this a couple times. I'm not sure why. I wouldn't, I don't know if I'd want to live forever. I think I'd get bored. I think I'd just be like, okay, I'm done here. Like, this is long. Maybe the not age thing, but then just choose when I'm done. Do you know what I mean? What is your worst habit? Worst habit is probably overthinking. What is your guilty pleasure? I don't really have any gu guilty pleasure. I'm not really guilty about anything I like. Jacob Sartorius has a couple bangers. You can't even lie. Bingo and hit or miss are, uh, are quite the tunes. I can't lie. So when you sexy your I'm not sure who you're talking about to be honest. <laughs> Favorite country you've ever visited? Oh America, but New York. New York was just such a dream. I can't even like I need to go back to like fully experience. I went with my mum and my dad when I went and it was cool, but I wanna go back like by myself, like, you know, with the love of my life. <laughs> Brooklyn in particular was just like so vibey. Oh my god. I sound so lame, but I loved it so much. Fave memory from Newstead. If you don't know, Newstead is where I went to secondary school and sixth form. I would say year nine performing arts. We did like musical, Camp Rock 2, we won. That will forever be one of my favorite memories. How big is your, bigger than yours, mate? <laughs> Plans for summer in the city this year. If you do not know what summer in the city is, it is a YouTube convention. It's like the largest YouTube convention in the UK or something like that. This year, I am planning on going. I was there last year. Last year, I did the. I was on the smaller YouTubers panel, which was such a good experience. Um, this year, I am gonna be moderating a panel on sunday so if you want to come check that out i think it's at 4 p.m on sunday or something if you are coming to somewhere in the city and you see me please say hi because i can guarantee you i will look awkward yeah apart from that apart from the panel i don't know yet what my plans are thoughts about mental health and depression and how to deal with it hmm. what i will say what i will say is that i see a lot of the time on social media tv shows films all of this People, I want to say, romanticize and like trivialize these mental health issues. I've said this before somewhere. I think I read it as well. It's like the pain someone feels should never be made to be something romantic or beautiful, or poetic. Do you know what I mean? Like in terms of like how to deal with it, there are many people you can talk to. I know it's hard, it's annoying to hear stuff like that because with me, for example, when I'm feeling down or any anything like that, the last thing I want to do is talk to someone which is probably the wrong thing to do yeah defo obviously safest thing to do is speak to someone favorite color favorite color is baby blue that there's no question how to be confident in your abilities basically how do you keep motivated and tips for self-confidence um so for me i think the best piece of advice i've ever read or been given stop comparing yourself to other people at the moment i just keep busy so i don't have time to compare myself to people even like scrolling through instagram and all this sort of stuff you just have to bear in mind that social media at the end of the day 
isn't real life it is fake to some extent confident in your abilities though you just have to believe and just keep working at it get in touch with who you are everything kind of falls into place and you don't really worry about what other people are doing and then in turn you become more confident in your video about first year uni you spoke about being mobbed off what happened oh <laughs> um i was telling you guys not to get mugged off i wasn't necessarily saying i got mugged off i can speak about things just to do with me but like when it's me and someone else or other people it's just like i can't because it's not fair when you finish university do you plan on staying in london or would you consider portsmouth portsmouth is just uni i'd be to be honest where i live isn't really that big of a deal to me but at the moment i'd say london and then maybe like move to new york are you going to some in city and do you think it's a good place to set up collabs yes i am going to some in city as i said like the whole collabing thing if it's not like if i'm not friends with the person do you know what i mean because i feel like it's a bit awkward you sit in front of the camera and then you're both just kind of like hi do you consider yourself an introvert or an extrovert i'd say i'm an ambivert somewhere in the middle what's one thing you wish you could do one thing i wish i could do read people's minds because people lie a lot so that i don't have to waste my time <laughs> what job are you doing i do a lot of stuff so one of my jobs i work at this laser tag place client work and then i do some web development stuff as well are you kenyan aside from being a citizen in the uk i'm kenyan and i'm zambian i was actually born in west london that's all the questions that i have for today um if you have any more questions comment them down below i'll answer them in the comments um but yeah thank you for watching if you enjoyed don't forget to like comment subscribe i'm about to do some exciting stuff on some other channels to do with uni thank you for watching i'm gonna go now but i'll see you next time so bye